Bill Fox, I'm a PCA here in the Yuma, Arizona, Bard and, and Roll area. Huh? I, uh, I've been checking fields, or I've been a PCA for, hold on a minute, let me figure this one out, 33 years. And, uh, and my, my main focus right now is checking on uh, the produce, the vegetables, the lettuce, the uh, cauliflower, the broccoli. And, uh, and that's where we're at today, right now. I start, uh, these things are planted during probably an uh, ideal condition for insect head, egg lay and, and plant growth. And, uh, and uh, insect pressure could be pretty intense from beet armyworm, uh, cabbage looper, uh, flea beetle. Uh, so basically the main focus is on, on field checking, uh, being out there and walking your fields every day. Uh, you know, thresholds are a funny thing in our is this time of year for us, is that uh, it's more of a gut feeling where you think, oh brother, uh, that I better better start doing something or I'm going to start losing plants and my stand's going to be affected. So, uh, you know, we do a lot of, you do a lot of field checking, you do a lot of crawling, you do a lot of, uh, you know, sleepless nights, but uh, mainly if uh, field checking is probably the biggest part of the IPM deal that, you, that vegetables deal with. The materials have gotten gone from a broad spectrum type uh, chemical to more select, where they're really targeting a specific pest. And uh, they're so much safer, REIs are much shorter, uh, days to harvest. Uh, it's just, it's just, you know, it's pretty uh, impressive when you sit down and talk about it. When you have to work around all these people, harvest crews, thinning crews, uh, to be able to go out and spray something that night and wait four hours and you're able to put people in it, that, that's pretty handy. I, I think the biggest thing, that what they hope they uh, uh, consider is that, man, just how safe these products are we're using anymore. I think that's one thing that, uh, you know, the industry needs to promote a little more that even though we are out being, killing insecticides, we're throwing out insecticides, we're, we're, we're spraying uh, pretty safe insecticides, but they're in the hands of knowledgeable people. I think that's one thing that, you know, that sometimes we get a bad rap of maybe we use too much. But uh, I don't think so. I, I think if you're out there doing your job and out there sampling and doing everything that uh, when you use an insect, insecticide, fungicide, whatever, pesticide, you're doing it with your, your grower's best interest in mind.